All right, this is Jason from Smiler Mobile. So right now I have an issue, and I figure I'll share it with the YouTube community and fix it with you guys right now. So here's my issue. See the battery over here? Battery, 4% available, plugged in, not charging. And I've tried everything. I've wiggled the battery. I've wiggled the sockets. Nothing's working. So I'm going to try something else here. Come over to this point. Type device manager. Open the device manager. Then I will uninstall the battery. And I have two of them, so I'll uninstall both. Okay. And then I will now take out the battery. So hold on. <clears throat> so you, you'll take your battery out and keep it out for maybe three or four minutes. <clears throat> At this point, you'll probably not be able to see the power-up bar anymore. The power-up bar is gone. So after about three or four minutes, now you put the battery back in. Now I'm putting the battery back in. And uh, then you'll come back to Device Manager. Click on the battery. Then come to Action and click on Scan for Hardware Changes. So when we plug it back in, we come back here and check. And as you can see, it did not work. Uh, okay. So, so let's try something new. We're going to follow all those same steps, but this time we're going to do a shutdown. Okay, so I have just restarted the computer after uh, shutting it down. So now that I've restarted it, I will, uh, and the battery's out, I will go back to Device Manager. try it again exactly what I did before uninstall and uninstall all right and then I will shut down and restart again but this time I'll shut down put the battery back in and restart again so stay tuned okay so I have uh, restarted it the battery's back in, so now I will check, and voila, it is now plugged in and charging. Okay, so I will quickly recap. We tried it two times. The first time, we didn't do a restart of the computer. What we did is, the first time we went to Device Manager, we uninstalled the batteries, then we took out the battery, waited five minutes, put the battery back in, did a rescan for hardware, and then looked to see if it was working. So when the first time didn't work, we tried it again. This time we shut down the computer first, took out the batteries, then restarted the computer, went to device manager, uninstalled the batteries, then shut down the computer again and restarted it. This time you don't have to do a scan because the restart, the restart will do it and this time it worked so thanks for watching please feel free to follow us on twitter.com slash smileandmobile you can also follow our blog at smileandmobile.wordpress.com and also please subscribe to this channel if you like this and there will be more to come have a good day